Oh hey, welcome to my humble abode. Come on in. Hello siblings, welcome back to my video. Today I'm gonna to be giving you an empty apartment tour. I am so excited about this apartment. It's like my dream apartment. Everything's up to date and it's two stories which I've literally always wanted. So it's like a mini townhouse. So I'm gonna give you guys a little empty house tour. It is gonna be echoey, but I'm excited to show you. And then stay tuned for seeing all sorts of vlogs here and when I get furniture in and stuff. So let's go on the tour. Before I continue showing you guys my apartment, which I'm so excited about, I'm even more excited about telling you guys about today's sponsorship, which is Pinecone Research. I've done multiple sponsorships with them. It is a great brand and it's a nice, easy way for you guys to make some last minute cash. So Pinecone Research is a survey brand where you can sign up and you basically get paid to take surveys, but it is unique because it is exclusive. It's invite only and you guys can be invited by clicking the link in my description. Because it's invite only, it provides exclusive opportunities. You've probably seen other survey brands out there, but Pinecone Research is the best. And you get a guaranteed payout for every task, higher than most companies. You can give your opinion on products and brands to earn points and get cash rewards. And then you can redeem your rewards via gift cards, cash, direct deposit, or products. This is what it looks like when you complete a survey. I feel like you guys are definitely going to love this, and I really don't want you guys to miss out. It is exclusive, so click that link in the description right now. And thank you again to Pinecone Research for sponsoring today's video and I will continue showing you my apartment. So as you just walked in the front door, you literally will see the stairs. And up there is my room, but we'll go there last. So then to the right of the door, it opens up into the living room. I'm not exactly sure where my plan's gonna be for the couch because I want it to feel very open. I'm thinking TV either there or there and a the couch here or here, some sort of L couch. Actually, you already know what couch I'm getting, but this is a little porch that I have. Oh my gosh, there are like six locks on this thing. I haven't even opened this one. Nice little porch. I will probably never go out there. Um, okay, and then over here, there's a really solid sized dining space, as well as the kitchen, a guest room, and a closet. So, come on into the kitchen. I love this kitchen. It is super up to date. We've got beautiful white granite, beautiful white cabinets, lots of cabinet space, solid sink. Does it not have one of those things that makes it spray? Well, that's disappointing. Oh well. Uh, we've got stove and oven, nice microwave. Everything's nice. Fridge. And then there's actually two little pantries over here, which is really convenient. So I can put all my spices and stuff in there and dry food and you know what a pantry is for. I don't know why I'm telling you. Got a dishwasher and we have washer and dryer in here. So I'm thinking I'll end up putting a dining room table here and then it comes with this really nice sized closet under the stairs, which is gonna be perfect for putting like my lighting for filming and stuff in there because I literally never know where to put it and just random stuff. I have a lot of storage in this place, honestly. So this is gonna be the guest bedroom, AKA my studio. This is where my streams are gonna go down. We're gonna get back on that gaming, streaming, game, game streaming, whatever. Let's open the window. Oh. Wow, this room is huge. It literally feels humongous. I think both the rooms are giant. I don't think I've been in a room this big in a while, but I'll probably put my desk in that corner. That looks like the most ethical corner. And then in here is the guest bathroom, closet, all of that. Nice little vanity, toilet and shower separate in there. I think it's kind of awkward how these doors are for the bathrooms, but we'll talk about it later. And then this is the extra closet, which is a pretty solid size for a guest closet. So that'll be nice for more storing of clothes because I have too many. All right, and now let's go ahead and head on upstairs. I honestly still can't believe that this is my place. Like, I'm so obsessed with this place, and it's mine. I get to decorate it and fill it up for a whole 13 months. All right, the thing I've wanted my whole life in upstairs. Okay, so my battery's literally stuck in my camera and dying, so this is gonna be fast. Go, go, go. All right, here's the master bedroom. It is huge, it's got two giant windows. I'll put my bed in the corner. I love it, I'm obsessed. We've got the bathroom in here. Really awesome, huge closet, like ginormous, which is amazing. 
And then this is just the same situation as downstairs. And I really like that there's cabinets over the toilet. That's so convenient. Never had that before in an apartment or anything. But yeah, this place is huge. I love it. I'm so obsessed. Wow, the fan is a really cute color. Good morning, it is a different day and I am obsessed with the lighting in the morning in this room. It's like so dark in here. I open these two windows and it is just flooded with light. It bounces off the mirror in the bathroom. I'm just obsessed. I'm gonna open these up all the way so it feels very dramatic. It's also like so dramatic in the morning. Like, let me just show you what I do in the morning. Sorry about the mess. It's gonna be messy for a while. So I get out of bed. Oh, good morning. Good morning world. It's so dramatic and I love it. I love it so much. I'm continuing this empty house tour into just a little bit of a vlog and a little bit of a catch up because it's been a couple of days. So if you haven't already, go watch my moving in video. Um, and then there's this video. And then coming up, I have my shopping for my apartment video. So this is a little bit of a sneak peek because I accidentally just showed you guys the comforter that I bought. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. Basically what happened was this camera is the one that I vlog on and the battery got stuck in the camera and I could not get it out and it was dead. And then my dad is in town and he figured out how to get it out so now it is out and now I can use my camera again <laughs> but I'm just gonna vlog a little bit of today and kind of combine it with this so you guys have a little bit more content in today's video so review on the apartment so far I've been here for like three days I haven't done so much in three days it feels like it's been a month um I love it I'm obsessed with it I this is like my favorite master bedroom I've ever had honestly and I just love all the lighting that comes into this apartment and I'm just obsessed I'm literally so excited to show you guys like all the furniture and stuff that I'm gonna buy and it's gonna be so cute here okay so like I said my dad's in town so I'm gonna go downstairs and I also need to edit so I'm bringing on my laptop and stuff. Oh my gosh I'm so sore from all the moving. Good morning. Hey good morning what's up? You guys putting together furniture? Putting together chairs. Yay. Yay. Last one already. Last one. Yay. So I don't have like a water dispenser in my fridge and every other apartment I've had had one. It does have an ice machine though but my friend Joseph bought me one of these things that you just like refill and there's a filter on it. And so far, it's been very convenient and nice. And I'm sure you all, okay, why is this out of book? You guys are probably like, you didn't know what that was, but I didn't until I went to my friend's and he had one. But now I have one, so yeah. <laughs> also, now that I have this nice wood table, I have to use coasters to protect it. So I have all these cute little coasters. But you guys will just have to wait for the other videos to see all of the furniture, but I will give you a little sneak peek. Boom, there's your sneak peek. Okay, and then my camera literally died when I was up here, so here's a quick little more in-depth tour of my room. And you get a sneak peek. So, dresser here. I'm gonna have a little vanity desk. It might go over there so I have the reflection of the window to do my makeup, I'm not sure. Two nightstands, there's my bed. I just shoved everything into the closet, but I have all this cabinet space in the closet, which is so nice. Um, I've kind of put together the bathroom a little bit. And then I have a huge closet. So this is very spacious, much needed. I have a lot of clothes. All right, actually, I think last thing for this video, I'm just gonna make some breakfast. First time making food in my kitchen. All right, I'm gonna make eggs and sausage, my go-to. I just realized I don't have any Pam spray, so I'm just gonna use olive oil to make my eggs. All right, eggs. My dad and Amy are gonna start putting together like my dressers and everything upstairs. Uh, making them do the hard work because I have to edit. <laughs> hey, gotta put them to work if they're here, you know? To make up for all the times that they said that to me when I lived under their household. You're here, gotta put you to work. So my dyslexia kicks in and that whenever there's this picture, I literally can't tell. Like I know it's obvious that that would be the front one, that would be the back one, but I still get confused. And this one says front and rear, so thank you. My fridge is nice and full of food. Um, I basically am in here talking to myself. This is you wonder what I what it's like when I live alone. This is what I do all day, just talk to myself around the house. Is that a sign of like you're really smart? <laughs> hey, there we go. All right, I'm actually talking to thousands of people if you think about it. All right, my sausage. And I believe this is necessary today. 
and I think I'm gonna eat three sausages. I usually do two, but this girl needs all the protein and meat she can get because I have been working hard. The lighting is really weird in here. Coaster. Um, so I got distracted. My eggs are severely burnt. My sausage is burnt, but that'll taste fine. I don't know about burnt eggs. Um, I guess we'll find out. I'm a little nervous about this. <laughs> I'm gonna lower the heat on these. <laughs> I got distracted because I'm filling out this form. When you move in, you have to like write down if there's any um, like issues with the apartment. Like if there's like paint stains somewhere or like holes in the walls or whatever so that you don't get in trouble for it when you move out. So I've just been doing all that, trying to do it nice and thorough and then I need to go run it up to the office. Look how perfect this is. This fits like literally perfect. Makes me so happy. Mm. It's not bad, but it's not good. All right, so my breakfast wasn't the greatest, but I'm gonna go ahead and end today's video because I just have a lot to do and I'm just excited to show you guys this apartment. Once again, thank you so much to Pinecone Research for sponsoring this video. You guys will definitely wanna check them out. The link is in the description and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!